Slam guys, hope everyone's doing well. Hopefully we're back onto this vlogging thing now. So, you know, it's gonna be a, a bit of a different video for us Slam for you guys. I know you guys are used to the dogs and whatever. Um, but this one, it's probably more for the car guys on the scene or if anyone's interested in seeing this video and whatever. But basically, I purchased a new car recently. I mean, I know it's not been that recent. Okay, it's not recently, but I'd say past two months, but it went in the garage for about a month and a touch after owning it for probably, what, two, three weeks um, just to get some work and whatnot done to it. But I don't know how we're going to do this. Do you want to show the car and then I talk about the specs or do you want me to tell you what it is first and then you're going to pan over? You do however you want. It's yours. It's... There's my new car. <laughs> Some cinematic music. Yeah, I'll get some better shots of it there. But but yeah, it's a 2012 Mark VI Golf R. The re if you know about me, you know about. Like I said, I'm not too much of a car guy myself. I just you give me a car and I'll drive it and whatever. But my brother used to have one of these. Best part what three four years ago or longer. Just about four to five years ago. Oh, oh, probably then. And um, I got to drive it probably one or twice or one or two times. Sorry, I just fell in love with it. We did purchase one probably on the back end of last year, but it was a category N car and it didn't last long. And then I ended up getting this one and on the lights. And it's not and it's and it's not stock, is it? It's not stock, no. So we when we brought it, it was a they say stage two, I think. It was pushing about 330, 333 on the dyno. However, the reason it went into the garage is literally about a week of me owning it. Uh, the turbo gave way and it completely went on me sent into the garage to get a turbo done again on it um, by our good friend way. ali um, uh, who's who will leave his information down below down below um he did a good job to be fair the uh, tur on the turbos. when they fitted the turbo and whatever i thought now nah, you know what i want more power out of it so then i sent it back in to get another one fitted but this time it's a hybrid so now this car is capable of going up to, I think, 450 from what I've been told. Yeah. It's not been mapped, like remapped again after that. So it's not running at the full potential. It should be running out with the turbo that's in it currently. So it should be running about 350 at the moment, 360. Around, I'd say around the 340 to 360. I don't know exact figures or whatever. Um, I am looking to, oh, again, talks with Ali, Ali, if you're watching. I am wanting to get it to about 390, 400. Uh, horsepower it's just a parts for you. I need to get uh, intercooler for it and whatever but other than that it's quite sweet to be fair um, would you say it's the the better car that you've owned or from the cars that you've had so far or out of for the little sports cars yeah or like the little hot hatches or whatever you want to call them it's probably one of my favorite it's like a little go-kart to be fair we'll go for a little little drive and whatever i know my brother's eager to drive it. he's not drove here since it's been fixed um but it's a fun little car the only thing i would say though is fuel efficiency half tank gives me what about 100 miles at most <laughs> so it's like yeah i don't really get the yeah, but you're not gonna, gonna expect me. to get you know like good fuel efficiency out of this i should have gone for the gtd or some sort like i don't know in terms of spec i mean it's got good spec to it to be fair, it's got leather, sunroof, which is quite rare for them, it's DSG, um, and yeah. There's the back of it. It did have a diffuse, was it a diffuser you said? No, split on the front. Was it a splitter? Yeah. Nothing on the, on, the on the back? No, nothing on the back. I had a splitter on the front, but it just kept scraping everywhere, so I, was, I just took it off and plus I prefer the more basic look to yeah. the car. Um, I know a lot, of more, a, lot, a lot of people prefer the split because it gives it more the aggressive look, I'd say. Mm -hmm. But I prefer it, it is. To be fair, I do like the five doors over the three doors. It makes it more practical. But like, mm. if we have a little look inside. No worries, mate. This, this lighting, is that a factory? That's factory, yeah, which is a, a rare thing to get as well. It's got factory, like ambient lighting, which is pretty cool for a car of its age. It's got like the, is it dyno or a, a focal yeah. inside? So there's, um, what were you saying about the speakers? So um, this one, I believe these normally come with the most popular one anyway, so I think it's called DIN Audio. DIN Audio or something. DIN Audio or something. Uh, Focus, you don't really get it too often. But the Cat In car we still have, the other Golf, that's got uh, the DIN Audio or whatever. And I can say that the Focus is so much better. Yeah. Um, basic, like, you can feel it a bit more. Everything is just more clear with the music or whatever. Um, uh, inside's pretty... The only thing that it's missing is the Recaro seats. 
But to be fair, if you, it's the way my brother drives it on these long motorway missions, these are a bit more comfortable. Uh, These seats are quite comfy to be fair. It's got the pan roof as well. well it's like a sunroof. Uh, but yeah, should we, uh, should we go out for a little drive? We Actually, we'll get like a noise start. Uh, like oh, a, a start off from there. Go on it as well. Do a, yeah. like a little bit of revving. There's some offices nearby, so we don't want to leave. And then we'll uh, just go for a drive. No problem. Yeah. Uh, Anymore, just because, like I said, there's some offices here. Yeah. Well, we'll go to a bit of a private, private, quiet location and uh, show you what's capable of. Yep. Especially in my mate's private estate, <laughs> things got a lot of work going on there at the moment. Um, we had there's too much traffic and everywhere. But if you guys want to see anything to do with the cars or whatever, just drop a comment down below. If you want anyone that's watching, I want to do any sort of collabs. If you guys have got a little, actually I say little any car to be fair, they just want to do a little collab with us and whatever. Just drop us a message. Um, but yeah, hopefully you enjoyed the video. Inshallah, we're going to start coming out with more vlogs and that for you guys. Something like this is a bit more random, like I said. We know we've got an audience that does like this stuff. There's probably an audience that isn't too asked about the cards or whatever. But yeah, just we appreciate your support and whatever. If you can, it'd be greatly appreciated if you can subscribe, comment, share. What's the rest of the intro? I don't want to do the intro. Like. Like, comment, subscribe, share, uh, whatever it is. Do the rest of it and all that. And yeah, Inshallah, we'll catch you next time. I love this. <laughs>